So let's take a look at classic load balancer. So it was AWS's first load balancer. So it is a legacy load balancer. It can balance HTTP or TCP traffic, but not at the same time. Uh, it can use layer seven specific features such as sticky sessions. It can also use strict layer four um, for balancing purely TCP applications. So that's what I'm talking about where it can do one or the other. Uh, it can perform cross zone load balancing, which we will talk about later. Um, and I put this one in here because it is kind of an exam question. I don't know if it still appears, but it will respond with a 504 error in case of timeout if the underlying application is not responding. And an application could be not responding, uh, spawning would be example as the web server or maybe the database itself. So Classic Load Balancer is not recommended for use anymore, but it's still around. You can utilize it, um, but you know it's recommended to use NLB or ALB uh, when possible.